Alright guys, sort of get a bit of the operation of this solar setup on video. It's in float mode at the moment, but I've got it set to come out of float mode early. For demonstrative purposes. I'll just uh, shut off the power. Once it hits that, that voltage, this is what happens here in flight mode. There's a slow pulsing until the voltage drops. We'll come back on again. It's the point where it goes back to flight mode. Not a whole lot of sun today, but there's enough to um, to demonstrate this. The code here. I've got it set so that it comes back out of flight mode at 13.8 um, or more volts just to demonstrate this but it should be down a lot lower than that the uh, small motorcycle battery that I'm charging is able to be kept up at a reasonably high voltage just by the flight pulses This is the kind of action I got happening now. It's not easy to see, but at that stage there, it's in the second highest duty stage. When it goes up that little bit. Clicks into the next higher duty stage, which attempts to pull the voltage back down. If it can pull it back down, it goes back. And if it can't, it stays up and keeps putting through the power. This here is the C2 voltage. This here is the uh, C1 voltage. This is the amperage into C1. And this is the uh, battery voltage over here. I've changed up to, uh, to charge that larger battery there underneath. It was already charged, of course. Um, 
because I'm uh, testing the float situation. It'll be a while before it comes up. Being the size it is with the current that I've got happening there at the moment. But to my way of thinking, if the uh, panel voltage is not going up to 20 volts, if the panel voltage is staying around about the uh, maximum power point voltage, then surely I must be getting about the maximum amount of current from the panels. It would be difficult to really know until I get full sun in summertime kind of thing. But uh, the action of the program seems to be at the moment working fairly well. Okay, put that line, it's hard to make it out, but it's, you can see it there, that's quite a high voltage, I'll show 10 volts in that scale, and then you see the little 10 volt gate pulses there, as compared to the Tall spike. 